Hey Scorpio, welcome to your reading for Virgo season. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you get all the messages I post each month. To my lovely loyal subscribers, welcome back guys. Well, let's see what we have for you. We've seen the Knight of Wands and the Five of Wands are uh, racing towards you there. Um, so somebody may be coming in to think, trying to make a mountain out of a molehill, some little disagreement and somebody, you know, wants to come to you and make it bigger than it actually is. I, like I did, just put it back in the deck and say, yep, yeah, I'm not about that because if people uh, want to argue with you and you think, well, they've got low energy or whatever, they're a lower vibrating, they're also bringing yours down and that's their goal. So <laughs> remember that everything in balance, you know, um, allow them to do it. You could be arguing with a Libra there, or they could be trying to return to you. Um, they have this inner turmoil going on, something to say to you. Let's see, Four of Cups now. So the Justice card and the Four of Cups, somebody's regretting, mistreating you. Um, I feel like they don't know how to make this up to you. It could have been that uh, you know, they argued with you. We've seen that five of wands. It could be somebody close to you as well, not just a romantic partner, friends and family, siblings, those sort of things um, that argued with you. Um, see the error of their ways or regret it at least. Uh, regret how they mistreated you here. And they don't know how to reach out and make this offer now. They're very unhappy with how things went. Um, for you, this could be boredom. It can seem like nothing's happening. Um, no opportunities are coming your way, but a huge uh, opportunity, um, something you've wished for is coming. You just don't see it yet. <laughs> well, you see the wish now, right? Okay, so the star here. So this is your wish being granted. You don't see it. I get it. Um, you know, when we're like, well, what's happening? Nothing's happening. I'm just sat here waiting. You know, sometimes you go in and you order some food. You know the food's coming, right? Because you ordered it. Well, that's the same with the universe. You order it, you have to wait for it to manifest. But it is, and this is to give you that confirmation that what you wish for is coming, even if you don't see it manifesting right now. It's yours. And that is because of this balancing out of karma. We see balance in the Four of Cups as well. Um, so, you know, where there's bad in your life, it must be returned to you good. Um, if you've been going through good, then everything will be in balance, right? You might be go through a period of a time that we quote unquote say bad. Um, but in the end here, we sow those seeds and we have to wait for it to manifest. So I feel like this is saying confirmation is coming. It's coming. The star is there. Justice is there. And love is here. This Ace of Cups, this, if it was a love offer you were waiting for, this could be somebody missing you and um, something you wished for here. I definitely feel that there is a lot of um, emotion already passed. If you're waiting on somebody new and somebody hasn't come for a long time, like you've been single forever, um, it's just while you've been clearing karma, you'll realise when you meet them, oh, I get why I had that time alone because, you know, now I'm going to spend all my time with this person. And yes, Scorpios, we spend all our time with a romantic person. That's what we do. <laughs> we really do. Um, it's not always good, but it's what we do. We had this discussion last time, right? That I'm territorial, not jealous. <laughs> I just want it to go right. I'm not controlling, but <laughs> yeah. Um, you'll you'll see that you know once you're in love you're in love and obsessive about your love so you needed this free time to be able to work on karma your healing yourself and bringing yourself and emotions into balance so yeah ace of cups is on the way here love is on the way it gets boring waiting but do you know something when you've had a life of trauma toxic people around you and you think, oh my God, nothing's happening. This is boring. You know, that's something that needs healing because you've been used to all this toxic energy around you. This is a time for peace. This is a time for healing. 
and relaxing. It doesn't mean, even if you're the one who doesn't want to do anything right now, that's your soul telling you, hey, it's okay to relax and rest. It's just as important as the work and the grind and the loving. You need rest as well. So Prince of Pentacles, this person's taken a long time to come forward and make an offer. But when they do come, they're ready for this committed energy here now. Um, and I think that's probably why it took so long when you have wished for a person who's ready to commit then they take longer to come, right? You made a bigger order. <laughs> so if you wish for somebody, hey, I want somebody who wants a one night stand, I'm sure you would have people lined up at your door, but you're not about that. So it's slow and steady here. Um, this is why it's taken them a long time to come. It's somebody you wished for here. Um, and I like that it's taken a long time, right? Um, because it's given you the time for you. Let's say if you met a soulmate early in life and you've already been in love or um you had to work all your life and you know you needed you time sometimes what we want and what we need are different things right so the universe always gives us what we need when we need it and what we want after it's been ordered so don't forget to make an order um ace of swords clarity um you don't really need clarity on who it will be you'll instantly know uh, with that Ace of Cups, that intuition is 100% on top. On the person who lies to you, it's who, Scorpio? You. Okay, so you're going to have a breakthrough in this as well. Um, changing, you know, how you approach love and people. Because you've had this complete overall of yourself. Uh, the Ace of Swords comes after the Ten of Swords, after the ultimate betrayal. After there was no way back and uh, there was no way to, you know pick yourself up from that you had to be reborn so it's time for this breakthrough it's time for you to come out the ground wearing your crown holding this sword high and being truthful to who you are and what you'll accept get real with people about who you are and what you'll accept and you'll find that this person filters through the cracks quicker right so they'll come in a lot quicker the energy is slow moving but hey five of wands it's come out anyway um, so this can be inner turmoil um, going on with yourself. But how we sort out that inner turmoil is, um, what do I call it? Mental pruning. As soon as you hear a negative thought coming in, uh, pl pluck it out. We've had years of being told certain things about ourselves so we can start to believe it. So we say... You know, well, that person said that about me. So, no, you want to be able to say, no, 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 I'm unlearning all that that's been taught to me. And I'm going to start telling myself that I am worthy of all this because I know how I do for other people. Um, so, yeah, I think probably Scorpio, we probably get the worst thing, right? Always. Um, so they'll say like, Scorpios are like this, Scorpios are like that, probably more than any other sign we get it so if you've had years of saying you're a scorpio so you're like that um <laughs> i guess there's a lot of unlearning that you had to do to be able to have this breakthrough and have this offer come in uh yeah a lot of learning the higher offense so a lot of wisdom and change had to happen before you met this person with the Hierophant and the Justice card, this can be the person you're going to marry. So this can be your life partner uh, that's coming in that you maybe aren't even expecting. But they're the best things when we aren't expecting. Um, so now the Four of Swords, the strong, silent type. Um, you've definitely been healing. You may find a time uh, during Virgo season when you have some sort of cold and flu and need healing and things like that. Okay um this is resting again what we was talking about that rest and rejuvenation is so important so if nothing's happening it doesn't mean that it'll never happen you might just be used to all this drama that's even unnecessary five of wands this can be people around you siblings friends causing arguments always dragging you into drama you needed a rest um with that four of swords okay and now we have the Four of Pentacles. So the 444 four, four is telling you you're going in the right direction to meet somebody. This person will never want to let go of you. Um, if you are struggling with finances, this is spending and saving wisely. 
in Korea may not be a good time to make moves right now. Could be still very slow energy in regards to money and career. Uh, I, I wouldn't be surprised. You could be bored. Uh, maybe a change of career and things like that approaching. So that would be wonderful. <laughs> we definitely have this union. Look at this. This union is coming. You may not see it coming. And, you know, if anything, you could be a little bit sceptical, Scorpio. Wouldn't blame you. <laughs> but you could be a little bit sceptical um, that this union or these wedding bands are going to happen for you. It could be that, you know, you feel like, well, my time has passed here. And no, not at all. You never know. I seen uh, when I was in Paris, I seen at this church, this little old couple coming out, getting married. I was like, oh, my heart is melting. Didn't even know I was such a romantic, but my heart was melting there. Uh, so you're on the right track to union here. And let's see gossip and small talk and neighbours. Money and wealth. Now, I thought I could uh, shuffle the cards, but I didn't. So let's have a look. I've made a mess of them now, but hey, you've seen it. Obstacles, pathways, blocks and delays. Um, so this is why they haven't reached you yet. They've been going past some obstacles. A blonde female. So it could have been they was with somebody else. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie to you, Scorpio. Nobody can except for you. So this might be why or what was the obstacles towards this union. Good luck, guys.